Hello you guys, it is JK and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be all about this look right here. This is the look that I had on in my thrift flip video and a lot of people wanted to see how I created this look so that's what I'm going to show you guys today. And yeah, let's get right into it and please watch until the end because I will tell you guys who these special vendors are. All right, for foundation today, I'm gonna go in with the Believe Beauty Skin Finish Foundation Medium to Full Coverage in Warm Vanilla. I really, really like this guy. Super full coverage. And it's just a pretty all around great foundation. For concealer, I'm gonna go in with my Tarte Shape Tape in Light Neutral because I'm gonna do like a full face. And I've, okay, I saw a TikTok where the girl only put concealer on the insides and on the outsides and I kind of want to see how it looks on me because I usually need a lot more coverage than just that but Tarte Shape Tape does it does blend out very very much alright that doesn't look that bad it's actually not a lot of concealer I feel like that would be a better way to blend out concealer because I usually go like that like a little triangle but I feel like this just kind of lifted up my eyes because I didn't bring it down too far. So I kind of like that. We'll see. We'll see after I like set everything on how I really feel. All right. That looks really good, actually. It still gives my... It still covers up my dark circles, but it's not as intense. Like I still, I don't look like a ghost, which I really, really like. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in with my Essence Brighten Up Powder. And I'm just going to take it on my e.l.f. Flawless Concealer Brush and just pat that in. Like, look at how much it just blurs everything out. Like, you can't see anything right here, whereas you can see on this side. For the rest of my face, I'm going to use my e.l.f. Finishing Powder with a large... Um, Sedona 370, 376 brush. Alright, so really quickly I'm going to go ahead and do my eyebrows off camera and then I will be back. Alright, let's get into eyes. Okay, so for my eyes I'm going to be using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Jackie Ina palette. And I really like this palette. It's a weird mix of colors, but basically we're going to be using this ruby shade. Like, oh, that's so beautiful. It's like a fiery red situation okay so let's get right into it okay so first things first we're gonna go into ginger which is this coffee brown sort of shade and we're gonna pop this into our crease and blend it upwards all right next we're gonna go into edges which is like an orangey copper burnt orange shade and I'm gonna put this on the outer edge of my eye and bring it kind of like a third into the crease. All right, so I'm going to go into an e.l.f. crease brush or any other smaller fluffy brush and I'm going to go into Credit, which is a dark chocolatey brown. And this I'm really going to focus closer to the lower lash or to the lash line and the outer edge. All right, so now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and take a flat tip brush and I'm gonna go into the that ruby shade that I had shown you guys and I'm gonna pack this on my lid oh my gosh I love that so much and I'm just gonna do it on the other side I'm leaving the inner corner empty on purpose because I'm gonna go in with that Zam shade which is like a glittery gold metallic so I'm just putting this on the outer the outer edge not the outer outer edge but like the middle and then bringing it in but I'm gonna go in with something different in the middle or in the very out, very inner edge. All right, for that inner inner corner, I'm gonna go in with I'm gonna go in with a smaller flat tip brush, and I'm gonna go into that Zam shade, which is like this glittery gold, and really put that on the out the inner edge. And see how it just gives you like a more awake eye than if you had just brought the red all all the way through, but. Oh my gosh, this looks so good. There wasn't that much fallout, but I'm just going to brush the lower part of my eyes away. And let's do the lower lash line. So for the lower lash line, I'm going to go in with this e.l.f. smudger brush. It's like a really, really small, densely packed brush. And I'm going to first go into credit, or I mean ginger, sorry. So 
So I think I'm just gonna leave the lower, the lower lash line with just the ginger shade and that's it. And just kind of keep the focus on the actual red. So now it's time for contour. So for contour, I'm gonna go into my Anastasia Beverly Hills contour kit. And I'm just gonna pick up the two warm tone shades on my Face Secrets brush. And I'm just gonna bronze up my face. All right, so I'm gonna go into my Physician's Formula Butter Collection and go into both of those blushes with a How You Doing brush from the Friends Collection. I like this brush because it's actually a lot smaller than most of the blush brushes that I have. And I feel like it just kind of fits right into my face. And then I'm also going to take the two highlighters from this as well. I've actually really been enjoying these highlights. Alright, so for lips, I'm going to first go into this um, Jordana Lip Liner in Coral Flame. Okay, so over that guy, I'm going to go in with ColourPop's Ultra Matte Lip in Know It All. And it's just a really pretty, like, red. Well, almost red. I'm gonna go ahead and throw in some lashes and then I will be back. All right, you guys, so this is the final look. I just wanted to put up, point out some notable vendors. So my jewelry is all from Wowsome Designs. My dupatta is from the one, the only, Shahidani by Bobby Luxury Dupattas. And then my skirt is also from Vikyati on Instagram and they're all super super sweet they have so much cool stuff so do go ahead and check them out and I will post a video of my full outfit on my Instagram so I will post a video of my outfit fully on Instagram and on here as well so be sure to check everyone out and make sure that you show them some love because I love this look so so much but with that being said don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I will see you in a video super super soon Mwah. Bye, guys.